back, we are going to start to decorate the tree. I was going to do it earlier, but then I didn't have enough lights for this tree. Um, so I had to run to CVS and get the 70 count. Um, I just came in from checking on the chickens. And it's getting a little chilly, really. So if I'm sniffling, that would be why. But welcome back to Vlogmas. Let's start with the lights. Okay. Let's plug it in first. Make sure they all work. Even though this is a smaller tree, it um, the ones from the dollar store were not enough for the tree. So we're gonna have to bring you along and let's start decorating the tree together. <laughs> oh, that would be my Sophia with her backwards knees. Hopefully, it'll make it look better with the more lights. And now I can probably take it all the way around. I think the other strand was only three. Let me see. 20 lights, and they're five feet, and it didn't even go all the way around this tree. So I'm just going to get it around it, and then I will fix it and tuck it all in. So all that fun, good stuff. my place I got a real tree and I always use the dazzled lights once they came out who remembers those the dazzled lights oh I wish they had them when my kids were little it was so easy to decorate a tree and then I got an artificial that's gorgeous you hear barking There's extra dogs here you all liked the cleanup and the decorating that I did. It just took me a lot longer for why I didn't do like a come clean with me because I was packing some items. And fantastic news, if you know Mr. Garden State Gardener, I will be over there. Uh, I go live Sunday nights at 9 Eastern. And Mr. Garden State Gardener wants to interview me at um, 7 o'clock Eastern tomorrow. So come on over to watch that. really hoping that this would be enough lights on a little tree like this. Let's see. So yeah, that's exciting. Mr. Garden State Gardener is going to be interviewing me. So come on over, like I said, and check it out. And I think I'll take this part here and tuck it all in. It has white snow on it, so it's getting it all over, but that's okay. This is so much better. I would have I wasn't thinking when I was at the Dollar Tree where I would have gotten another set for $1.25. Couldn't beat it. These were seven at CVS. We 
channel. Hopefully you can see all that. I did get to see all that. So, let's take a look. Sophia. <coughs> I must have goofed a little bit. I'm going to try to adjust it. Hold this strand down a little bit and tuck it in. Okay. Let's see, shall we? I have one dog in. Both of my dogs are in here. I have to fix that one wire. And let's see. Let me lower you down. And take a look. I don't know if you could see that wire right there. Let's see what it looks like. Hold on, my friends. looks much better than it did so now I have to get together well I have to fix the, one of the wires and I'll get the Christmas ornaments together that I grabbed just to have something festive in here not too shabby At least this strand lets me go completely around the tree. So, pretty good. You know, with lights, you always have to adjust. And I did try, I think this was a more like ornamental tree for like someone's house, but I did pull the branches down some. And it's in this, um, which it has snow all over it, but it's in like a ceramic pot and in the inside it's got really hard stuff. So it's not even like it's in foam. So I will be sure to clean the snow up when I'm done. Let's get the Christmas ornaments out. Let's put them on the bed. So let me take you over to here and lower you down. Okay. So this was the previous lights, which really would have been good if I would have gotten like, mm, Maybe two more boxes to equal three. That would have gave me 15. Um, I have a previous picture and it looked absolutely terrible. So we have some hooks. Let's get the rest of the decorations out of the bag. And let's decorate. This is what? Day nine. Yes, we're definitely Vlogmas nine, but I wanted to look at my advent. I couldn't really find it and it's right there <laughs> all right so we'll get to that as well okay we have some bells I guess I could lower you down a little bit more now we're just going to use this area ornaments and decorate the tree. We also have this, but I'm not sure where it's going to go. And I think that's about it. Something is better than nothing. Let me put this in the bag. I had picked up this sleigh so you can see that for the tree and I decided to put it over there okay 
So let's start decorating, shall we? I have some hooks. Glad I remembered to get some hooks that day. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get all these off and bring you back and then we'll start decorating. Some of them had tape. Some of them had wire. These have staples. One thing that's going to be a little disappointing is I always put my mother-in-law on the tree. I have an ornament. In my kids' ornaments, but, you know. Um, so I have a picture out of my mother-in-law and father-in-law from my wedding. She was a wonderful, wonderful person. These are decorated bells, it says, 16 of them. Look at these open. the strings on it. I might just put a hook on it. Ugh, they do. I want you to do all the, all the strings if you want to hang them. <laughs> Unless you use hooks. Okay, what else is left? This one shouldn't be too bad. With the tape. Now the reason for, I might end up going, might end up going to my friend Jay's tomorrow to do my interview and possibly my own live. Um, Eagles are on down here. Tomorrow is starting at 8 something. And I didn't want a lot of screaming and cussing. Um, so I may just go there. Because Jay won't do that. While I'm live or being interviewed. And there's just extra dogs and stuff. So it just might be best if I just go there. Okay. Two more pieces of tape to take off. And I think we should be ready to decorate. So they give you this really, really long gold string. So... I don't know, because I'd have to get scissors. And let's see what it would look like with just a hook. Let's see which way. That shouldn't be too bad. We can try it and see how it goes. Okay, so I don't have a ton of decorations here for on the tree, but we're just going to make it work. And I still haven't gone around and cut off tags. So. Okay, let's put you over here. Oh, might have to get my plug. I just went out there. I told you I'm not crafty. And asked Jean... She can make me a bow out of this. And she literally said, no, it's a skill. <laughs> okay. We'll make dough. We'll put that around the tree. Um, I definitely can't make a um, bow. And I could YouTube it, but I'm going to try to do this with no edits. And let's see if I can get you a little bit closer because you're on the wire. Well, my phone is plugged in. Okay, let's see if you can stand right there. Let me raise you up. Shouldn't be anything here stopping it from sitting straight. Okay, anyway, let's get a hope. So I don't think I'm going to put the string on the bells. And let's just start with hanging 
these little trucks. I'm obviously not going to put anything in the back because this is all that I have. So we want it to be in the front. Already, and the hook fell off right back into the container. I think I'm just gonna, I think, dump some out in a minute. Let's try this again. Let's see. If you hear anybody talking, that's just Jean and Thomas out there. Okay, yay, we got it. one decoration on there. Oh, uh, I guess we'll do all the trucks, then we'll do the trees. We'll grab the trucks. So one, two, three. And there's number four. Okay. I had to stand back to see what it looked like. Okay, so after this jazz is done for Vlogmas, I'm probably going to do a canning session of pinto beans. Because now I'm going to put some up. And then I didn't want to start baking too early. So I am going to be making different types, oops, different types of cookies. I like the thumbprint with the jam. I also like shortbread cooking, me personally. And that's not sitting right. So, yes, risotto rice because that's very yummy and delicious. A little bit could be a little bit on the fancier side. Great for like maybe New Year's Eve or Christmas. Okay, having trouble with these hooks. I don't want anything to fall. Hmm. We want a truck up there because I think that we only have one truck left. Try it again, shall we? I am trying to pinch. There we go. And then maybe one more truck over there. So where's the last truck? Okay. But yes, yeah, so I didn't want to start baking too early. Um, but you can do cookie dough and freeze it. Bring it out and let it thaw five, ten minutes before you put it in the oven because I heard people say they don't spread right. Um, that's how I do it. And it seems to work out. Let's see. Where do we want this? We want it up here somewhere. Let's just stick it over here. Yeah, I'm not really impressed by the dollar store hooks. That I can say right now in advance. The hooks, not so much. Okay. Yay! We got all the trucks with the green tree all hung. 
And now let's go with hmm. I guess we can maybe start hanging some bells. Different color bells. But again, the hooks are not the greatest. Actually, I think we should do the trays and the wannabe gnomes. What do you think? Okay. I guess that's what we're going to do. Let's go with... Hopefully you're seeing this okay because I have you in the most weirdest spot. Oh yeah, so if you make cookie dough in advance to freeze it, so you're not stuck making a bunch of cookie dough, you have to make sure you cut it or roll it and then put it um, so that it comes to room temperature before you go and put it in the oven and they should spread just fine. Let's see. So I will be switching my Vlogmas up. And be doing all kinds of different things. Let's see. I've got a tree up here. has um like ribbon on the end of it but the knot was out so i had to fix it okay let's see let's put one over here somewhere let's go up a little bit and then we should have one more tree like I said, I'm not worrying about the back. That would be kind of silly. So you definitely can pull something like this off on a budget. For sure. Okay, now we have these, I think they're su supposed to be like wannabe gnomes, I don't know. <laughs> um, and then we have bells. And I have to make a decision on this, where this is going. Maybe this could go... Somewhere like this. Maybe. Like I said, hopefully you're seeing this all okay. Alright, let's go in with these little fuzzy gnomes. We'll just put these all over. If I put that bell up, you're not going to see it up there. So I also, hold on. I also have a Santa, two different Santas. And I think that's it. So let's hang these. Oops. 
hang these as well. Let me pull my, there we go, pull my plug. And we'll Hmm. Okay. I had to plug you in. It's complicating things. There we go. Okay. Let's see about. This one. I feel like let's see. Let's figure it out. It doesn't look goofy. <laughs> and there's no decoration on this little branch, so this might be okay. Then budget friendly for things like this. Just definitely get different hooks from somewhere else because I really don't care for these dollar store hooks. The lightest thing, it's not even holding. That's too big. That might be better. Okay. Let's get the rest of these up. Thank goodness we're not doing my big tree. I'm very particular about how I used to always do my tree. But anyway, as I was saying, I think I brought this up, those bedazzle lights. I wish they had them when my kids were littler. I have like four or five. Absolutely love them. They make decorating with lights way easier. more to go with these. This ribbon is still in my bullpen. I'm trying to be super careful and how I'm stretching and with my left arm. I went to urgent care with Jay because you want to, if you know, you know, my elbow has been killing me. I'm not sure if I heard it on the chicken water that's three, four gallons. Um, said it's sprained and could be something else going on, obviously. And uh, it's going to send me for an MRI to see what's going on with my elbow. So we have one there, one there. I'll bring you in closer in a minute. I just feel like this like sand is taking up a lot of room. But I can't really see this car if I leave this. So let's see. 
adjust something very quickly. Let's maybe put the core over here. All right, one more left of this. I don't want to bore you half to death, but I wanted to bring these along. I decorated the tree. So yeah, so not just be lifting or doing anything like that with the arm. You may think in the meantime, I'm just going to take this sander down because it's throwing me off. anybody sees anything on this tree that you're like think should be different just don't even hesitate let me know down in the comments will you please Hmm. Women are funny, aren't they? I have to figure out where this other one is going. How about we just put it aside? I think this truck was here, but you just heard me exhale because the hooks are not even holding that great. Okay. Now, let me bring in so you could see. Show you. Pretty cutesy. Okay. Now I need to fig figure out the Santa and this gnome and some bells. I'm really hoping that you can hear me over there. Don't mind me. I'm in comfy sweatpants and a um, polyester shirt. Because I took a bath and a shower and gave myself a little attention. So... this left, this gnome, this little Santa, this Noel, and we have to decide on this bell. Or the bell. Hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, let's put some bells around. Probably so boring to it. So 
since I didn't bring it for a full come clean with me and decorate, I figured I'd bring this back to decorate the tree with me. There. I really do think this tree was like obviously ornamental like if you got to and you have like a farmhouse kitchen <gasps> that would look so cute but that's okay at least I figured something out once I saw that my basket disappeared I keep scrounged, but I already ate. So, what is your favorite cookie? Maybe you can leave it down below. And if I see one that seems interesting, maybe I will make it. Whether it's a family recipe or favorite cookie since you were a child um favorite cookie as an adult you can leave it down below and give me some ideas for some different cookies if there's extra bells i might put them on the sides hmm. remember their name but um under the dollar tree hall said their dollar store what i got would have cost a hundred dollars isn't that crazy dollar stores are so different and people are not really spending like they used to all right i won't bore you to death i'll put the rest of the bells on Now, let's see about this Noel. Try this Noel sign again. That should be okay. And then. I'm gonna have to figure those two out. As a matter of fact, let me take this down for a minute. Because I think what I want to do is go in with some gnome ribbon. And then, of course, I'll bring you in closer so that you could see. And if you hear anything, it's just my dog looking. Let's get the ribbon on. Let's see what it looks like. It might be a little long. I might have to cut it. Hmm. Let's see. Could start at the top. Maybe I won't have to cut it if I take it all the way around. I cut this piece to turn it into a bow and I couldn't make a bow, so it is what it is, my friends. I 
on about this okay. ribbon, but we will figure it out. I'm not used to doing my ribbon like this. I'm used to doing it where it's hanging down. So let's see. Make a few little adjustments once we get it up there. Okay, what are we thinking? Let's see. All right, let me do some adjusting. Okay, I just fine-tuned a few things. And I decided not to put the bow on the top. And I'm going to put a little gnome there. But I will bring you in closer so you can see. I just have a few bells left over and one Santa. But I'm sure I'll figure it out. But we just decorated the tree together. So let me bring you in closer. Okay, so I'm just going to scroll it from here. Go nice and slowly. Voila. Now I just have to clean up all that. Like I said, there's a few bells left over and I put that ribbon there. So what do we think? How does the tree look? And let's see what it would look like, even though it's not cleaned up. We'll turn this off. Whoops. Wrong one. And this is where it might not be that easy to see, but there it is. There's the tree. I think it looks cutesy. Good enough, right? I've turned the ceiling on, ceiling fan on by accident. Yeah, I think it looks adorably cute. I mean, I've done better, but under the circumstances. And look, it has all that white snow all over it from the, the tree, but it's a pretty decent looking tree. And I just have the gnome kind of climbing out of the ribbon. And I'm sure I'll find a spot for the rest of these little bells. But that is the tree, all done and decorated. As I'm sitting on other things, I think it looks not too bad. Okay. Let me put the light back on. And we will do the advent calendar. Okay. There's the light. If you want to see it up close again with the light on. Yeah, I just have to clean this up, but. And what do you think of that up there? I wish it was a gnome bow. That would have looked better. Okay. Let's do. I'm going to put you down here a second. Get our advent calendar. So I know my vlogmas is probably way different than everyone else's, but. Like I said, bear with me. It's my circumstances. That's why it is the way that it is. And um, I'm probably going to take you out looking at lights 
and we're gonna do cookies and we'll make a couple desserts so hang in there with me and we are day nine and i saw earlier where did it go hmm. i think i lost it again <laughs> oh yeah that's right it's all the way up here so let's do number nine and I ate my candy last night. These are so good. I know I've heard, or not heard, but I mean, I've always liked this chocolate. This one and Godiva is my favorite. And um, I think it was my friend Fran. Uh, Tree Arts, the channel. I can't remember the rest of the channel name. I'm so sorry. But she agreed this is a really good chocolate. So I'm going to open this up. Because I have to go around and clean up my mess anyway. We're also going to do. In one of my vlogmases. Like when I'm baking or cooking. Whatever I'm doing. We'll discuss like my top Christmas movies. Mm. Oh, I got myself this today. And I got the lights, because if you know, you know, I love dark chocolate, and I love these cellos with the clear liquid, not with that dark sugary stuff. So, I did get that. It's a little treat for myself for Christmas time. And this was the sleigh that I had for the tree, but I think there's enough up there. I think that looks fine. I just have to clean it up. And... Have I told you how much I don't like the dollar store hopes? <laughs> but day nine, and I'm not going to edit the video. Hopefully, you were able to see everything. I mean, that's why I th I'm glad I did a Dollar Tree haul so you could see what I picked up. I'm not really sure how I feel about that ribbon, but that's okay. Um, it's still super cute. And then the other little lights. Um, what did I do with them? Oh. I put them across the vanity. So that is my day nine vlogmas today. Bringing you along to decorate the tree. And now I'm going to clean up my mess. I'm sure I'll fine tune some things and you'll say it. Um... Yeah, but thank you everyone for hanging out with me and decorating the tree. We're supposed to have really bad weather here uh, starting tonight and all Sunday. Don't forget, Mr. Garden State Gardener, I will be interviewed tomorrow at 7. Um, go over, subscribe to him so you can see the actual interview. Love you all. If you're new here, it will cost you absolutely nothing to subscribe would love to have you here. And I guess I will catch you on the next vlog, vlog 10. Thank you everyone for decorating my little itty bitty tree in the room that I rent. I greatly appreciate it. Stay blessed, stay well, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye friends.